weekend's top moments in a supercharged, overstuffed edition of your MTN Game Changers. We'll start with Central versus Lewistown boys at number five. Central on the break, Gabe Dos Santos looks like he has a wide open layup, but Gage Clinton skies in for the monster block. Rams would get the last laugh with the win though. Let's go to Great Falls High and West boys. Here's Terrell Rollins on defense. He tells Josh Erbacher to keep it. Huge block gets the Bison fired up, but West goes on to win. At number four, some nifty passing. Scobie versus Freud Lake in the Eastern Sea Semis. Caden Handron, marvelous no-look pass to beat the zone. Braden Cromwell gets the easy finish. Scobie claims back-to-back -back titles. Let's go to Fairfield and Harlem boys in the Northern B Semis. Harlem on the break. RJ Ramon goes behind the back to Brad Sehos for two of his 31 points, but Fairfield wins a nail-biter on the way to a division title. At number three, two plays from Central and Haver girls fastest hands in the state. Sadie Phileas gets not one, but two key steals in the final minutes. Kadia Miller gets a layup on the other end to give her team a late lead, but with 2.7 seconds left, Central down three. They inbound to Maya Hansen at the top of the arc. One dribble, fires, and hits at the buzzer. Hansen forces overtime, where Central knocks off the two-time defending champs. At number two, R. Lee versus Deer Lodge boys in the West B Championship. Second half we go. Cody Tanner with the steal. Arley on the break, but Ben Anderson out of nowhere. Huge block to keep it a two-point game, but Arley would seal it in the final seconds. Zach Running Crane ends the game with a monster dunk, and that'll give Arley the title in their first year as a Class B program. At number one, Fort Benton, the top team in the state for a number of reasons. How about versus Belt in the Northern Sea Semis in the final second Garrett Decons puts the finishing touches on a big win with a two-handed slam. And then in the Northern Sea title game, his brother Hayden Decons in transition flips up the circus shot. It falls and he's fouled. Decons with a game-high 17 points. Fort Benton wins 57-39 and move to 24-0. They're heading to state for the first time since 1992.